Hi guys, Blue Fence here, and Dog Dog, as you can see in the background. Right, I was sent an email. I um, do apologise about the person's name, I truly cannot remember. I'll try to remember to put it down here, but it's more time, and the name doesn't. I don't think I saw a name on the actual email, so I do apologise for that. But it's a random question. I know I brought up a video on how much power cord does how much power cord do you need to carry and the one I said about looking for power cord and everything like that as you all know I've got three spools of power cord right now. If you give me a second I will show you. Three spools of power cord. Yeah, and I showed that. This person asked, because you have this, how much do you actually have on here? So, truthfully, honest truthfully, I don't know. I've changed a few bits out. I've took a few bits away. As you, uh, as you can see on that side, I've I've just got this that pouch now instead of the other pouch with zips. There is a foot and a half to two feet of power cord on either side. On those side of pouches, these are three and a half feet each. Most of these, um, I have power cord here. As you know, what's kind of keeps this pouch on I have my cash oil connected by a power cord lanyard um I have a power cord on the zips I have power cord on key gear I don't usually like doing this but this is small gear I don't want to lose like my small knife sharpener, what I use for my hooks, a set of tweezers, a spare striker, and one of these army style can openers. And not just that, it, it gives extra grip, it, it gives an extra length to hold on to. Um, on my main Verisian rod for Mad Dog, the Mad Dog Monster, I've got the power cord on here I don't can't remember how many inches is here I really can't remember what he said but there's power cord there on my first aid kit in the back of the first aid kit I actually put a power cord handle on a red power cord handle on not many people know about that until now um, so really, I think I'm probably roughly, without the 300 feet here, I think I'm roughly carrying maybe 85 to 100 feet just on gear and on the rucksack and on gear itself. I reckon roughly, as I said, I'm not, I don't care, potentially. And that's not including all the pouches. That's not including all the ones that's here. I'm talking about even the ones on my in my kit, like on my fire kit. I like the fire kit. My um, my boot kit, not my boot kit. My hygiene kit. All all my pouches was got zipped on it. I've changed every single one, apart from the fire kit, of course, because I haven't touched that one yet because I'm still having a button involved with black or red. So yeah. It's just crazy things like that. And yes, I can admit it is a lot of power cord. There's even power cord on my camp shovel I put on. Yeah, I know. I know a lot of people are going to think that I've lost it. I know that. I get that. I understand that. But to me, power cord to me is one of the things what's going to be the hardest thing to make out in the world. I've tried to do this, this string with the stinging nettles. And it takes time. I know all this is cut and all this is short things. I know these are two between, I think these are three and a half feet of them already each. Not all of them, of course, because some of them are smaller than the others, but most of them three and a half feet roughly. So, yeah, I know that. I understand that. And that's quite a bit. So, yeah, I hope that answers that question. I'm hoping it doesn't make me sound like I'm a bit of a weirdo. Because I already know I'm a weirdo when it comes to stuff. As you can see, I've just I've just been adding power everywhere lately. I don't usually like power cord gear. I don't usually like power cord on gear like that. But that 
this more time has been so much better for me to use than just that. So that means I have to hold it there and I don't have the strength in my hands to hold it properly. I'm not going to lose it now because it's going to clip. The same as that one on the can openers. These can openers are all hard to hold, but now I have that piece of power cord on it. I can hold it and they all are different lengths. They're not all the same length and I don't know how much stuff on there. But as I said, I roughly think I'm carrying just over 100 feet in power cord just on stuff like that. And I reckon there's about at least 65 feet on this rucksack before I go anywhere. Right, I hope that answers that question. I do apologise if I sound like I'm babbling along. Yeah, I know it sounds really stupid and silly me saying this, but I'm trying to get organised. I'm trying to cut down on stuff. And that's one thing I'm trying to cut down on. As you can see. Three different types of three lots of power cord plus some more med stuff. I've got some red power cord I've got extras other places and I got bank line in places. So yeah, a lot of power cord. So thank you very much and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.